If you've ever 3D printed before, you know how crucial a good first layer is to the success of the rest of your print. Have you ever had a print fail because the first layer was too low or too high? In 3D printing, even fractions of a millimeter can make a big difference. Here you'll see my voxel starts off printing too close to the bed. No filament can make it out of the nozzle. We'll need to perform what I call nozzle gap calibration. Leveling the bed is more when you're adjusting the plane or the tilt of the bed in respect to the X and Y axes. Instead, in this case, we'll be adjusting how far the nozzle is from the bed when it starts printing. Before starting calibration, it's good practice to remove any dried filament from the nozzle. I'll do this by going to preheat, turning off the bed, since we're not worried about that right now, and heating the extruder. Once the nozzle reaches 100 degrees or so, you should be able to remove the old filament with pliers or a brush. Once you're done, just abort the preheat. We're now ready to begin calibration. Go to Tools, Setting, and then Calibration. While the nozzle moves to get in position, grab a piece of paper. Since my nozzle was too low, I won't be able to slide the paper between the nozzle and the bed. I'll need to move the nozzle upward with a positive offset. Regardless of your scenario, the goal here is to get it so that the nozzle is just scratching the piece of paper. Once done, I click OK, then completed to store the new calibration. You'll see my next print is coming out normally. If yours isn't quite right, take the time to redo it until you get a perfect first layer. You'll thank yourself later.